Welcome to Just Gaming. We are doing a thing called Visual Novel November. Uh, currently, at the time of recording, Steam is doing an event called Visual no uh, Visual Novel Fest, and I decided I'm I would go and download every single free-to-play visual novel that they had uh, on that they were offering at the time. So I got all those downloaded, and we are going to be recording these all throughout November. So uh, yeah, th today we're doing. Woo! Today we're doing Lilith Wants to Buy Your Soul. <laughs> and, I can only, and given it's in red, I can only assume this is Lilith, so who wants to be Lilith? I'll do it. Okay. Okay, Lynn. There's no start screen or load menu. Are you surprised? When you make a phone call, do you ask the <clears throat> do you ask the other person to press uh, to press start before speaking? When you text someone, do you first <clears throat> do you first show them gra uh, graphics and pretty pictures? This isn't a game, so there's no reason to have a start screen. I would rather call this my method of communication. Oh. Oh. <laughs> There's like. Hmm. Oh, hello. It's nice to meet you, Andrew. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> did, oh shit! Did this game really? actually read my really? computer? <laughs> Probably. Yeah. I... Oh my god. I it's just like the it's just like that one game we were playing before, you know, uh one shot. Uh last chance or something. Yeah, one shot, one shot. Yeah, we gotta get back to playing that. Doki also does it. Oh yeah, oh Doki Doki did that too. Yeah. We but... gotta continue all those games. My Doki god. Doki is also a free visual novel, so we could include it. Yeah, definitely. Mm. We'll get back to we Doki can include Doki. It in visual novel November. Anyways, um yeah. okay. Hi Lilith, thank you for outing my real name. Though, when the other <laughs> games come out, I'll, my name will already be out it, so... You can always believe it. Was that your name? Since I'm a little far away. Sometimes it's hard for me to understand who I'm... Uh, who I'm talking to at times. Honestly, the more I look at her, not gonna <laughs> lie, Lilith's kinda doing it for me. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like something right out of Doki Doki. She really does. A little bit. But right now, I'm talking to you, Andrew, right? Ooh, okay, I have an option to uh, maybe change my name. Yeah, I'm gonna mm -hmm. go for it. No, my name is not Andrew. Then let's fix that. You can sign a contract with your real name. After without... Without... Without your real name, after all. Oh my god. Court. Please. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I myself go by many names. But you can call me Lilith. No shit, Sherlock. Through chain letters, strange emails, posters, and even and even paintings. Now this is out of the mental image of my brain. What does a train layer look like? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I like trains. Uh, did you say... I like trains. Choo-choo! Choo-choo Charles! Woo-woo! Oh my god. <laughs> I've always appeared to people and given them a special offer. I've made them an offer they can't refuse. A lot of times they don't believe me, but sometimes they do. And for those people, I can change their lives. That's not always a good thing. Talking to me this through this so-called game. Oh shit, this is Doki Doki. I, <laughs> I was wondering if you want to make a deal like that for yourself. No thanks, I don't feel like selling my soul today. You sure about that? A devil's bargain. 
Uh, no thanks. <laughs> so I'm not asking you to accept it right away. Just asking you to listen. Okay. So are you interested in what I have to say? Why not? Yeah, sure. I'll listen to the sexy demon. <laughs> That's great, Tor. I'll draw up a contract now. Faith is gonna kick your ass when she sees this. <laughs> For you, Court, give me your soul, immortal soul. And I'll give you a... 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 You're gonna give me the letter A? That's great! <laughs> oh shit, you don't have anything. A. Is this Sesame Street? Yes, we get the layer A. A uh, something. <laughs> this might be a problem. <laughs> Normally, we have everyone's soul. Uh, we have everyone's soul price here on on file. But it seems that your file was misplaced. Uh -oh. Hooray! Lilith doesn't know about my sins! <laughs> I'm sorry. Even though I've been doing this for many years, I'm still just an imp. I'm sorry, what? Yes, I, aren't you married you... to Lucifer? I was about to <laughs> say, you just be lucky she hasn't found your fanboy folder, Court. <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. I have, a, I have a bad habit of losing things. And sometimes I even go off script. <laughs> Let me explain. My job is to uh, my job is to acquire souls for the afterlife. Everyone's soul has its own value, a price that we're allowed to pay for it. <clears throat> what we can trade is always different. Sometimes we can give you diamonds and rubies. The sapphires, aww. <clears throat> Other times, we can give you a fried fish. What? Unless it's paired up with some chips, I'm not sure I'm interested. <laughs> yeah. So you see, whether I can give, uh, whether I can give you worthless stones or a delicious snack, it's usually decided by, uh, by the head office. Worthless stones? All of you know the diamonds and sapphire are some of the best characters in Steven Universe. Yeah. And they all come together to make a beautiful garment. But if I can't find that file, how can I make you an offer that the, uh, in the first place? <laughs> Is it under the desk? Under my chair? Stuck in my clothes somewhere? Oh my god. No striptease! <laughs> let's, ch let's check these papers one by one. Uh, one more time. Suddenly, because of Cinemason's <laughs> video, this scene does not contain a lap dance. <laughs> <laughs> it's hopeless. Thank, the, thank God you're not topless. <laughs> Bing! Now this is interesting. I think I can gather enough information to offer you a deal. Girl, honestly, I'd be fine with just a vacation to Aruba. <laughs> By conducting this test that I found, <clears throat> I can understand your soul value that way too. I'll just ask you uh, 20 questions. Um, same number as the children's game. And we can learn how much your soul is worth. Oh great, we're playing 20 questions with the devil. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who's answering? It's you, of course. No shit. No shit. Heh, <laughs> I beat you to it. I said it first. No, I did. The you, behind, the you behind the screen, Court. Then, after talking, uh, after taking the test, you can decide whether you want to sign your soul away. Well, at least I have some semblance of a choice. Yep. 
Shall we begin? Eh, why, why not? Th why not? What have I got to lose? Only my soul. <laughs> All we want is your soul. <laughs> Let's start then with the soul ap uh, appraisal. The first question. Uh huh. Remember, this affects the value of your soul. I get. Get to the question already, girl. Are you more of a cat person or a dog person? Oh my god! That's like choosing between my children! <laughs> oh my god. Um, uh, oh. oh, you're... I love both of them! I love both cats and dogs! Me, Me too! too. Uh, um... It's like... Oh, oh my gosh, it's just like what James from the Odd Ones Out say. He says, I'm bisexual for animals. Wait. <laughs> I'm not kidding. He says that in his cat. He says that in his cat video that he loves both cats and dogs equally. So, but okay. Uh, I know. I know. And he actually says, "Wait, that came out wrong." <laughs> cats are so fluffy and cuddly, that... but dogs are so loyal and fun to play with. It's just... and they both give you the best cuddles. Uh, and they both relieve your and every time you pet them, it's like the all your stress melts away. Uh, sure. uh, and they're so goofy, and when they look at you, they either like give a little yip or meow. Mm -hmm. uh, especially when cats, especially when cats meow, and it's like really loud. They go. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna close my eyes and pick one. Uh, uh, uh. Cat. Hey! What? what? Wrong answer. What? What? I didn't know there were wrong answers in this game! What the fuck? To be honest, I'm more of a dog person myself. Did you have a lot... Um, did you know a lot of people who let cats have... Um, have attachment issues? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Are we god. guessing if she's a dog or... You know what? Best to go through this whole thing and not even give a shit. Yeah. Yeah. I I'm just... Uh... Well, let's set that aside for now. The next Whatever. <laughs> Would you rather eat burgers or ramen? I like burgers. Burgers are nice. Me. Yeah, me too. Oh, like yeah. Right. Ramen's good too if it's made right. Yeah. Some tells me given the fact that she looks very anime esque, I get the feeling Robin's the right Robin's the right answer. Let's see. What? So you like burgers too? Okay, I guess this game's going against all my expectations. Hmm. Are we guessing what she likes? I mm. I have I, I don't know. I I just don't know. Alright. Fuck it, and I'm not talking about her. I, I wish your taste in pets was as good as your taste in food. Fuck you. Oh shit. Not myself. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it fun? <clears throat> Isn't it fun to take a quiz like this? No, not, not with really. you. I know you're a human and I'm a demon, but it's great to see what. Uh, what we both enjoy. Okay, so this is a situation where we have to guess what she likes, so... So I guess we have to both have the same interests, otherwise my soul will be worth nothing or something? I don't know. My guess is. I don't know. Are you ready for this next question? I think it's a fun one, too. Does your life have any meaning? Um... Oh, fuck. Why did you pause there? I'm, I'm, um... That was a pretty, uh... Cats or dogs, burgers or ramen, whether or not a life has meaning. Haven't you already thought about these things? Uh, that question was a bit, um... Uh... One of your scientists said people consider 15,000 things every single day. 35,000. What, 35,000? I guess considering this question was in one of those. Oh, fuck you! Uh, <laughs> but I don't mind 
mind if you take your time? I can wait for you. Oh, thank God, she's a patient demon. So, does your life have any meaning? Hmm. Yes. Uh... Faith would say so. I'm gonna say yes, but I get the feeling it's gonna go in a philosophical route where it's like, and it's like, no, no human's life has any meaning, so I'm just gonna say yes and not give a shit. That's a really funny expression you have on your face. Shut up. But well, he is a jester. <laughs> <laughs> if these kind, kind of questions are hard for a human like you, then we can go back to cute pets. Imagine that there's a box in front of you. In that box, is there, uh, is there a cat or a dog? Let's go with the dog. Yeah. Woof, woof, woof. <laughs> okay, I put that dog in a box. Now, when we open that box... I don't know why when you said that, all I said of was just use my friend for the group. And then, I'll put that flea in the box, and I'll put that box inside of another box, and I'll mail that box myself! I still <laughs> think we should... I still think we should do a script reading of that. Yeah. Is the alive. dog in the box... Is the dog in the box dead or alive? Alive! So, you're a dog... Uh, you're a dog half-full person, huh? That's sweet. Now I've put you in the box. Hey! No one puts baby in a box! <laughs> when I open the box, will you be dead or alive? I'm gonna say alive. alive. Somehow, I'm not surprised. If I was dead, you would've shot me or stabbed me. I don't know, used your demon powers. Or it could be a coffin. <laughs> but the most important question is, If I can open you up on the inside, uh, are you feeling dead or alive? Oh, alive. Well, alive because you can still feel pain. No, but here's the thing: if I say I'm feeling alive, that's basically saying I'm feeling like a rush of adrenaline. That's basically what people say and what people mean when they say they feel alive. Hmm. Hmm. Your heart's beating fast. I'm gonna say- I'd say you're pretty damn alive. Okay, I'm gonna say I'm feeling alive. <clears throat> oh, the trolley question. Now it's- Now it's trolley. Trolley is driving down some train tracks. If the trolley goes- Uh- if the trolley goes on, then, it will run over five people. Oh, this is a classic question. However, you can flick, uh, you can flick a lever, and it will, uh, and it will run over one person instead. Whether you pull the lever or you don't pull the lever. Do you look away from the, uh, from the, from the tracks? Oh. I would look away. Yeah, look away. Now look at me. Okay. You have very pretty eyes. I'd say look. Okay, I'm looking. Have you been putting a lot of thought into these questions? Don't bother answering. I already know. Eight minutes? That's longer than average. Did you tab out and leave me uh, and leave me here all alone? No. I've been here this entire time. Or were you just thinking that carefully? I mean I got two other people in my ear giving me opinions, so <laughs> Regardless, that's all the questions. Uh uh from Form A. What? We just finished the uh, appraisal's first half. 
Harry. <coughs> Feedback from other uh, from other teachers. Let's see. Mystifying, obscure, not enough cats. <laughs> not enough cats. Zero out of ten. Would not recommend. <laughs> <laughs> we did fix that last part about the cats. And then and then you you said mm. was wrong for choosing cats. Hmm. Hmm. What do people have to say about Form B? The next section. <clears throat> Straightforward. Simple. Not enough cats. <laughs> <laughs> What's with these last suggestions? <laughs> we, <Did he? laughs> we can't just put cats in this game just because people like them. That's not how things work! You just said it wasn't a game! Neko Neko! I'm gonna pet the kitty. Neko Ko Neko! <laughs> Setting that aside, Cord. Our... Uh, our time together is coming to a close. Alright, but you didn't ask me all the 20 questions! Let's oh. finish the, uh, the appraisal with these last 10 questions. Okay. <laughs> Ready to continue? Sure. Why not? Great, Court. Then let's start with question 11. Do you live alone? Nope, I live with my parents. A little fun fact for you guys. Same. Do you want to live alone? Not at all. I enjoy living with my parents. Family is important. Same. It's good to have company. Do you have a partner right now? Yes, I do. Then, are you married? <laughs> no. I thought so. What do you mean by that? Someone playing a game like this couldn't possibly be married. Ouch! Burn! <laughs> Get the ointment. Still, Cord, I have to apologize. But not for the reason you might think. I had some questions, um... There that weren't on the form just then. It's not that I'm interested in your relationships or anything like that. I was just, uh, I was just uh, teasing you. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> oh, oh, she be one to fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> if you look on my game page, there's at least three downloads. What? Hold on, let me let me t see that for myself. Uh, doesn't say how many downloads it has. Eh, whatever. Not worrying about it. About it. Sure, why not? Let's go with that. <laughs> I'm not lonely at all. Let's just get back on track. Oh my god! <laughs> Lilith is a sundere! Hmm. When you wake up in the morning, what do you do first? Not that I can guess. Do you look at your phone? Uh. Not really. First thing I do is actually like. I have like a long stretch. Hmm. Then I hope you get a good breakfast at least. Of course. Uh. Then, do you ever scroll on your phone without thinking? Eh, no. Then, are you giving me your full attention right now? Yep. Good. I'm pleased. I know focusing can be hard, so let me help you. Oh. How's this? <laughs> she just turned the game to full screen mode. It was in window mode I previously. Ah, um. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> How do I? I didn't know. <clears throat> That's weird. <clears throat> okay. okay. <clears throat> we have to make the most of our of our remaining time together, you and me. 
Now for the last two questions. Oh shit. Do you have any dreams? Yes, I do. Are you pursuing those dreams? Yes, I am. Hell yeah, he is. I'll cheer you on. Yay, I have a demon for a cheerleader. <laughs> do you believe you have a soul? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm here for. Do you believe you... God, do you believe you own your soul? Yes, I want to say... Question mark. Do you believe you you own your time? Uh, I'd say so. This last question is... A little hard to ask. What's your favorite ice cream <laughs> That's me. Really? Uh, I have to go with chocolate. I love me some chocolate, baby. Me too. Good choice. What? If you chose strawberry, then that means your soul would be worthless. Oi, don't wow. diss the strawberry! Yeah, strawberry's good, especially if it's made with real strawberries. The only people who enjoy strawberry are people without... Uh, are people without taste buds. Oh, Seriously? <laughs> wow. Isn't that the color of your hair? And that's question 20. You see? The quiz was quick, fun, and painless. Just like it... Just like a test on BuzzFeed or... or uh, Facebook. Facebook. <laughs> My dyslexia made me want to say Facebook. <laughs> I think that's supposed to be what it is. They just I think it's the read things properly. I know, but my dyslexia <laughs> got in the way and made me read it correctly when it wasn't correct. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, God. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm well, we are talking to say. Huh? I was about to say, well, you are talking to a devil, so you are damned. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> what? Not... You're, you're not wrong. Oh, I'm all kinds of wrong, honey. I'm obviously going <laughs> to say that we're also using these results for, uh, for targeted ads. But only in the fourth circle of hell, where we hold social media... Uh, where we hold social media devs and marketing executives. <laughs> <laughs> now, one minute. Processing your results. Okay. One, two, three. Done! The certifies your soul is worth no less than a house in Iowa as a result of having taken the soul appraisal. Okay. Hey, okay, that's cool. not bad, especially if it's a really nice house. Yeah. yeah. Yay! <laughs> oh, look at the little avatar on the side. Oh, that's cute. Where? Right oh. there in the corner. Yeah, I see it, I see it. Aww. Congratulations. Your soul is worth... There's no comma. Uh... 48,000. Have... No, four... Oh. $483,587. Oh, that's, my, my soul is pretty expensive. Not bad. I like yeah? That. Yeah. I'm kidding. With that kind of money, I could give you a house in, a, um, in an affordable area. Ooh. Wouldn't that be nice? If you hit the... Uh, if you hit the print, sc print screen key on your keyboard... You can take a screenshot of this image. Oh my god, do it! <laughs> and you can proudly show your friends that your soul is worth a house in an affordable area. Isn't that something? Or isn't that amazing? <laughs> Alright. But even though that test was fun, that wasn't the reason we're, uh, we're talking right now. Before we part ways, this is my real offer to you, Court. Uh oh. For something with four, for something worth four hundred eighty-three thousand five hundred eighty-seven dollars, will you give me your soul? 
I would ask for an explanation. Yeah, explain, yeah. please. Your soul is appraised to be worth about $483,587. Yes, we've established that. I probably won't give you the money itself, but... I'll give you something worth that same amount. It might be an opportunity... Uh, it might... It might be an opportunity, a bond, or even an... Uh, or even an inspiration. As for what it means for me to have your soul. Maybe some time later, I'll ask... I'll ask a favor. That's all. Oh, great. I don't devil a favor. So? For something worth $483,000, will you give me your soul? Mm. That's up to you, Court. I'm staying at this. <laughs> Sure, why not? I'm not above making a deal with the devil. <laughs> Heart. She just really just gave. Believe it or not, after all I've said, I've never had someone go through with giving me their soul before. I'm a weak demon, you see. An imp. There are others, stronger demons. Uh, if you, if you sign a contract with them instead. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> They'll be the ones to own your soul because their power is more than mine. When I follow the script, people sign, but they all fought the others in the end. Still, I'm happy you trust me now. Does that trust mean we can finally now. go out? Contract complete. <sighs> now that this has all been settled, I guess this is finally goodbye. Yeah, this has been this has been real, and this has been fun. It has been real fun. I don't think so. Has yeah. been. Yeah. When I say I guess this is goodbye, that means you're supposed to close the game. Oh. Unless you still want to spend time with me. Oh. Let's see where things go from here. She's making a face. <laughs> Why? Because you're cute. <laughs> Why are you still here? Could it be because of those extra questions? I I'm, I'm really not that lonely. Sure you're not. Then get a dog. <laughs> I, I don't care that you're losing... Uh, that you're looking after me like uh, right now. Please. If you stay here like this, then I... I won't be able to... Before you go, I should make a confession. About the soul appraisal. Okay. Souls really all have the same value. When it comes to the... Uh, when it comes to the contract, we just give an offer that we think you might accept. That's all. Really? The test is just supposed to help us uh, guess what you might agree to. Uh, guess what you might agree to. So in a way, you could say that I'm... Uh, that I'm running a scam. Maybe I don't belong here as a demon after all. Because of the very... Uh, at the very end, I couldn't keep up... I couldn't keep up the lie. Not to someone like you. <laughs> Aww. She's really into me. <laughs> <laughs> but 
There's a lot of demons out there in the world that might try to uh, that might try to make you believe something different. That your soul has a value of this or that, and you should give it up to them for whatever it is they might uh, they might promise you. Maybe they'll even tell you that uh, that it's worthless and act like they're doing you a favor. But you should be grateful for scraps. And I don't want you to give your soul to someone like that. I want to be the one to have it. That's why I'm being honest with you. Oh. Or if I don't get your soul, then I don't want anyone else to have it either. Oh, Yandere. Selfish, jealous, disorganized. <laughs> Overly talkative. I'm kind of a mess of a demon, aren't I? A hot mess. Hmm. Mm. But promise me that you won't let anyone else tell you what your soul is worth. And if you don't give it to me, then you'll at least keep it for yourself. Your wishes, your desires, don't give them up. Please. I promise. Mm -hmm. I'll hold you to this promise. Of course. I don't think we'll see each other again. Mm -mm. When I said I was a weak demon, that part at least wasn't a lie. <clears throat> As the years have passed and people have uh, stopped believing in things like me, it's become harder for me to show myself to you, even like this. When a demon loses its power, we go to a place called fiction. You well, can say yeah. that even... Uh, you could say that even though this is real right now, in the end, this experience will still turn into a game. Whether it has a... Uh, whether it has a start screen or not. But if that happens to me, with the... Uh, with the memory of that promise you made, or, uh, or fail to make, I'll still be alive. Even if I can't show myself to you, then I'll, uh, then I'll still be watching over you in my own way. Ah, so I got a little shoulder Ooh. demon. <laughs> I'll remember these questions, and the time that we spent together, even if you forget them. Thank you, Cord. So does that mean we're not going on a date? <laughs> and farewell. Are you kidding me? That's the end? I guess so. Looks like it. Holy sh I wonder the game is free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, it seems like one of those um one shot. Me no, it looked to me like because there are some game jams that have like they challenge the game devs to use limited amounts of assets. And there's ah. one there's one jam that only lets you use one image and like with s very minimal variations to it. Oh, um, okay. So yeah. that might be part of that one asset game jam. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. Well, next time on Just Gaming, we will be playing another visual novel. Yay! That sucks! <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Let's take my that. calls. <laughs>